Nothing says luxury like lobster, especially when it serves sizzling hot off the grill. Our next dish comes from down under, Morton Bay Bugs, grilled with ginger mint butter. A Morton Bay Bug is a clawless lobster similar to a Florida lobster or Caribbean spiny lobster. The first step is to cut it down the back using sturdy scissors. Next, cut through the tail meat to, but not through, the soft bottom shell. <clears throat> then open the lobster tail like a book. This is called butterflying and it maximizes the surface area of the lobster exposed to the fire. Then brush each cut lobster tail with melted butter or extra virgin olive oil. And season with coarse sea salt and cracked or freshly ground black peppercorns. The next step is to make the ginger mint butter. Melt salted butter in a saucepan and add chopped fresh ginger, chopped fresh mint, grated lemon zest, and finely chopped garlic. Place the pot on your grill's side burner and cook until the ginger and garlic are fragrant. Then add freshly squeezed lemon juice and Asian fish sauce or soy sauce. Simmer the basting mixture for another minute and turn off the heat. Set up the grill for direct grilling and preheat it. <laughs> I'm warming up here. Preheat it to high. And as always, before grilling, clean the grate with a few strokes of a stiff wire brush and oil it with a folded paper towel. Dipped in oil and drawn across the bars of the grate. This prevents sticking, of course, and helps give you well-defined grill marks. Now take the lobster tails and arrange them on the grill, cut side down. Cook the lobster tails for about six or eight minutes on the bottom and to speed up the cooking, you can close the grill. After three or four minutes, give each lobster tail a quarter turn to help them cook evenly. Once the lobsters are brown on the bottom, turn them over. Start basting with the ginger mint butter. And if you ever want to impress your company, just strip a little butter on the grill and you'll get a dramatic flare up. And again, you can close the grill to speed up the cooking time. Total cooking time on these lobster tails, about 10 to 12 minutes. I think the lobsters are ready. To check for doneness, use the old poke test. They should feel firm to the touch. Just before serving, baste one more time. And with the lobster, here's a mango pineapple salsa. The recipe's on the website. 
For more information and recipes from this program, you can visit our website at primalgrill.org. Primal Grill was made possible by...